In today's Medico Apps Masterclass, we will learn about trigeminal nerve or the fifth cranial nerve. Trigeminal nerve we know is a mixed cranial nerve which means it will have both sensory nerve components as well as motor nerve components. We will look at first the sensory nerve components and then we will look at the motor nerve components. The sensory nerves, the three sensory nerves associated with the trigeminal nerve or other divisions of trigeminal nerve. One is the ophthalmic nerve, maxillary nerve and the mandibular nerve. Let's look at one by one each of them. So ophthalmic nerve carries sensation from the ophthalmic division and finally end up into trigeminal ganglion via superior orbital fissure. Similarly, maxillary nerve carries sensation from the maxillary division and end up into trigeminal ganglion via foramen rotundum. And finally, the mandibular nerve carries sensation from the mandibular division and end up into trigeminal ganglion via foramen ovate. So, and all these finally terminate into the sensory nerve components finally enter into the trigeminal ganglion which is a part of the trigeminal nerve system. From the trigeminal ganglion, the nerve fibers enter into the pons in three distinct nuclei. First is the mesencephalic nucleus, second is the main sensory nucleus and third is the spinal nucleus. Now, main sensory nucleus and spinal nucleus are associated with general sensations whereas mesencephalic nucleus is specifically associated with proprioception. From these three main nuclei, we have fibers which originate and end up into the thalamus and this is called as trigeminothalamic tract. So this was about the sensory nerve components of the trigeminal nerve system. The motor one is very simple. It has a mandibular nerve branch which enters via foramen ebon into the motor nucleus. So motor component is very very simple. Also you will realize that the mandibular nerve is a mixed nerve which means it has both the sensory as well as the motor component whereas the ophthalmic nerve as well as the maxillary nerve are purely sensory nerves. Let's look at the most important point about the trigeminal nerve system. So trigeminal nerve or the fifth cranial nerve has both sensory as well as motor roots and hence it is called as the mixed nerve. Also it is the largest and thickest cranial nerve. It is also the nerve of the first brachial arch. You remember the mandibular branch of the trigeminal nerve supplies all the muscles which are derived from the first brachial arch, notably the muscles of mastication. Let's move forward and look about the trigeminal ganglion also called as the gesserian or semilunar ganglion. It lies in the Meckel's cave or dural pouch. Peripheral processes of the pseudo unipolar neurons from ophthalmic, maxillary and mandibular branch end up into the trigeminal ganglion. So we have seen that there are three nerves v1 v2 v3 that is the ophthalmic nerve maxillary nerve and the mandibular nerve they all carry the sensations from the these particular divisions and end up into the trigeminal ganglion and from trigeminal ganglion central process from the sensory root enter into the pons via three nucleuses mesencephalic principal sensory and spinal nucleuses the blood supply of this uh, trigeminal ganglion is mainly via internal carotid artery but also middle meningeal artery, accessory meningeal artery and meningeal branch of ascending pharyngeal artery are blood suppliers to the trigeminal ganglion. Let's look at the trigeminal nucleus in the center in the pons. So there are three components mesencephalic, primary sensory and a spinal nucleus. So this is the diagram where we see that there are three components V1, V2, V3 finally ending up into the trigeminal ganglion and from the trigeminal ganglion we have uh, fibers which end up into the pons which, uh, which is forming the mesencephalic nucleus, the principal uh, sensory nucleus and the spinal nucleus. Also proprioceptive signals from the extraocular muscles and the muscles of mastication via trigeminal ganglion end up into mesencephalic nucleus. So mesencephalic nucleus is mostly concerned with the proprioception. 
and finally we know that motor nucleus which is very small via mandibular nerve supplies the muscles of the first pharyngeal arch especially the muscles of mastication let's end today's medico as master class with this brain teaser question mandibular branch of trigeminal nerve is a mixed nerve true or false if you know the answer write in the comment below don't forget to subscribe by clicking here and once you have subscribed hit on the bell icon so that whenever we upload a new medico apps master class you can be notified about it check out this next medico apps master class which will be helpful for you